Meghan made huge coup after Palace quietly honor Charlene Post's rare shining pics on Jubilee event. Princess Charlene has left fans gushing after the Monaco Royal posted rare pictures of her children getting ready to enjoy the Principality's Grand Prix. Princess Charlene joined her husband Prince Albert and twins Jacques and Gabriella at the Monaco Formula One Grand Prix on Sunday. However, the Commonwealth silver medal medalist also shared some photographs of her seven-year-old children ahead of one of the Principality's biggest sporting events. Gabriella was shown wearing an adorable floral print dress while holding a pair of binoculars. Jacques was seen wearing a blue shirt and grey trousers as the young prince sat on the sofa putting on headphones. The mother of two captioned the Instagram post, focused on the win. Here's to a great Grand Prix. Fans of the princess were quick to take to the comment section to share their appreciation for the post. Instagram user at Bose Grubo said, Good to have you back. At Anitam Kleon added, her fringe has grown back. Other users also took the opportunity to welcome the Grand Prix back to Monaco. At Lan of West Huizen said, we will be watching, Monaco is one of the best circuits. Enjoy, wish we could be there too. The post also received more than 23,000 likes. The 44-year-old princess appeared at the Grand Prix after she recently returned to Monaco following a 10-month absence. The royal had been in her native South Africa where she was forced to remain after contracting a severe ear, nose and throat infection. She was seen last month with her children and husband for the first time since November after spending time in a treatment facility for exhaustion. Mexican racing driver Sergio Perez won an incident-packed Monaco Grand Prix as his Red Bull teammates prevailed over rivals at Ferrari. Max Verstappen, the reigning champion, finished narrowly behind Spaniard Carlos Sainz Jr. as the Dutchman took third place. Charles Leclerc was unable to make the most of home advantage as the Mornay Gosk driver finished in fourth. Brits George Russell and Lando Norris finished in fifth and sixth. Royal commentator Amanda Platel is worried Prince Harry and Meghan Markle will overshadow the Queen during Platinum Jubilee celebrations as the Sussexes visit the UK as a family for the first time. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have been warned by a royal expert they are not welcome at the Queen's Platinum Jubilee events because the Duchess could overshadow the royal family. The scathing remarks come from veteran columnist Amanda Platel, who also criticized Meghan's visit to lay flowers at a memorial for 19 school children after the mass shooting in Texas as it was in front of the world's press. Although the Queen has limited appearances at the Trooping the Colour on June 2nd to working royals only, the Sussexes will be making an appearance for other celebrations during the monarch's four-day weekend. It marks the first time the couple has returned to the UK with their children since they left their royal roles to leave for America. Platel, 64, fumed in the Daily Mail, I shudder to think what Megs might have dreamed up to grab the Jubilee limelight. I'd remind her the coming days are a celebration of the indefatigable Queen who has dedicated her life to service, not self-service. Having abandoned their royal duties and Britain, vilified the racist royal family and heaped opprobrium on Prince William and Prince Charles, what right do the Sussexes even have to be here? Will Oprah Winfrey fly in with them to reign on the Queen's parade? I believe I speak for many when I say, Harry and Meghan, you are not welcome. Please just stay away. But the royal couple has reportedly vowed not to overshadow the Queen with their visit after it was pointed out a clash with Lilibet's first birthday on June 4 could cause an awkward situation. There isn't much wriggle room to fit in a birthday party for a one-year-old.